sit now and show you the swatches because <laughs> you won't know how high pigmented these are. These were really cheap both, and I think they were really worth it. I was so glad I bought them. Like, I can't even explain how glad I am. Um, I heard some good things about them. Some people, I mean, like, it, it wasn't anything below four stars when I checked the website. Um, but it wasn't like these particular ones. They had like another, they had like a trade case that was like $25 and everything. And they said they liked it. So here's the duo ones. Uh, this is the black and white one. I'm going to swatch them now. Ooh, okay. So, really, um, you would think they're matte. They're not matte, like, I swear. So, here's the white one. I think you can see that, but here's the white one. Here's the black one. Yeah, you can definitely see that. Look how pigmented that is. I didn't only, I, I did, like, only two swipes, and it's really pigmented. Um, um, then... Here's the light purple one. I don't know if you can see that. And then the dark purple. And they're both, they're like, they're all really pigmented. And I'm sorry, I'm trying to find the camera. And they're really good, actually. I really like them. And um, I haven't actually tried them on yet, so I can't tell you if they're, you know, they stay long or they fall off or blah, blah, blah. But I, I'm pretty sure they're pretty good. Um... Then I have, there's these cool purple ones, and let me swatch them. Here's the light, cool purple one. I think you can see the light colors. I'm sorry, it's like the light. Hold on. Can you see them now? Ah, there it is. Okay. And then that, again, only two touches, and it's really, I mean, it's highly pigmented, and it's really cute. Um, I don't know if you can see it or not, but they have really cute designs in the eyeshadows. And I'll show you it. They all have it, the same design. So these are the um, browns. Neutral colors, I guess you could say. They look like your skin color. And as you can see, look, look at that. Really pretty designs. And it's really cheap and really amazing. Um, most of them are like barely matte, I think. You know, they're not extremely matte. But I mean, it's... Yeah, I don't think you can see that because it kind of matches my skin color. And then, like, um, this really shimmery brown. But they're really pretty colors, I think. They're really worth buying. I just put my hand to that. Um, so, yeah. They're really slim, too. What I like about the packaging of the, uh, the eyeshadows is they're really slim. Like, some duo eyeshadows that you'll find in the normal drugstore stuff. And even, like, you know, MAC and everything. They're pretty thick a little. They're a little bit thicker. These, and... These are really thin. Like, I swear. Like, these are so cute. Like, the H, uh, the Hip Duo Eyeshadows from L'Oreal. Those are thick. These are really thin, and they're still highly pigmented. So, if you want to dupe to the, the L'Oreal ones, I guess you could use these. Oh, okay, I should use my other fingers now. It's not showing up. This is the only color that I haven't been able to show up really nice. And it's this greenish color. These are the colors. This is green, the green one. I don't know if you can see that. I'm sorry. I'm trying to find the camera. But, yeah. And then here's the gold one. It's not really gold. It's like a coppery gold. This is so pigmented. Um, yeah, that's a pretty color. That is a really pretty color. Again, it has really nice design. All of them have really nice... Like, it's the same design. It's so pretty. And then it comes with um the lipstick. And the lipsticks are actually really creamy. Um, they're a little bit greasy, but they're pretty creamy, so they're totally, totally usable. Let's see, that's the color, and it's not really, I mean, it's pigmented, it's just really weird how it applies. That's okay, you can just use a lip brush, I guess. And then, here's the purple one, it's like a deep plum color, as you can say, ooh. But here's the color. I'm just going to put that on. And it, it just really applies weird. That's the problem I have with it. Yeah, that. I don't think I'll ever wear it, though. I don't think I'll ever wear it. I'm not really, like, a, a crazy color wearer for my lips. And then it comes with mascara. Mascara is pretty small. I don't know if you can see that. This is really small. And it's in, I think it's in black. I'm pretty sure it's black. And it, the brush application, the brush is really small. And it's nothing really special, so I wouldn't have to say, I don't have a lot to say about it. Hold on, I don't think you can see that. Just see that. You can see that. It's, I really don't have a lot to say about it. 
<laughs> I haven't even tried it. I don't even want to try it. Um, here's the eyeliner. It's a black eyeliner. I haven't tried this out actually. This is the only thing I haven't watched. Really, it's really nice. It's really, uh, it's not too creamy. Like I hate when it's really creamy because then it starts to like, like even the lightest touch, it like starts just go down. It really annoys me. So I like this kind where it's not too hard but it's not too soft. And then here's the red lip liner. And again, it's like really, oh my god, it's just like a crazy red. There it is. I can't see it. My hand, my finger wasn't really pointing at it, but it's under it. So, and then here's the blush. I'm not gonna really swatch the blush, but they're pretty pigmented too. Here's the blush. Um, here's one of the blushes anyway. The only thing I don't like about this blush is the packaging of this blush. I mean, I mean, like, I like the packaging in general for all the things, but, like, I hate how this opens. Yeah, it's open like that. Like, I really don't like that. But anyway, really pretty colors. I'm not going to swatch them, because I don't feel like it. But they're pretty colors. Actually, I'm going to swatch them just for the fun of it. Swatch with my three fingers. No one can see that. But it's a pretty color combination. Oh, there it is. Those are the three colors. I don't. This is the only thing I don't like about this blush is how it's packaged. I'm just really annoyed. I'm not gonna swatch the nail polish. And then here's the other blush. Just like a because of purpley tint. Ew, I hate how I open this. I really don't like how it's opened. That's like the only thing I have a problem with this thing. Is like how it opens. Okay, you can't really see it. I put it, like, on the side. And I don't know. Yeah, you can't really see it, but it's, like, over here somewhere. <laughs> um, and that's pretty much it for the first one. And then the second one. I haven't really swatched any of these. I only swatched, like, one, and then I stopped. Because my hands were already, like, crazy. And I had to wash them. Aww, good help. Here we go. So here's the palette. I don't know if you saw how it looked, but it's pretty much stuck. Okay. I broke it again. Here it is. It reminds me of a clear palette. <laughs> it's funny because they're like the blush cannot go on the eyes and the pressed powder cannot be used on the lips. Well, people would do that though. I probably would do that. Um, there's something I could really say. They're all really pigmented. I mean, like, just touching them and they come really pink. And I'm not going to swatch them because they come out the same colors as they, as they are in here. Very highly pigmented. pigmented. I don't understand because this is a pressed powder. The only thing I don't understand is, like, these are pressed powders. And then there's, like, one sparkly pressed powder right square part of the pressed powder. I think it's either a bronzer or it's supposed to be a highlight. That's the only thing that annoys me. And then here are the lipsticks. I'm just going to show you in here. Here are the lipstick colors. Yeah, and here are the nail polish colors. I don't know if you saw them here again. And that's pretty much my haul. I didn't really buy anything else. Well, I went to Bed Bath and Bo uh, Bath and Body Works. Sorry, I always say Bed Bath and Body Works. Bath and Body Works today, but um, they're pretty much not for me. Everything I bought there was like little travel size body fragrances and little travel size body lotions um, for my friends. And that's pretty much it. So. Um, Look out for my other video. I'm going to be doing a makeup tutorial very soon. Bye.